So we are down at Wimbledon today. I've taken a very short train from central London, just 10, 15 minutes to get here uh, because I'm here for an overnight stay at the Dog and Fox Hotel, which is just up the hill uh, in Wimbledon Village. We're going to give you a bit of a show around of that hotel and show you all the great things to do in the area. So I've just checked in. Thank you very much. So let's go and check out the room. Here at the Dog and Fox, they have 28 individual bedrooms and they feature boutique rooms, premium boutique, terrace suites, and also they have some beautiful feature rooms as well. So I'm staying in room number four, which is the Fox Suite. Here we are. Let's have a look. Wow, so we are in the Fox Suite, which is one of their feature rooms, and you can see why. It's amazing. King size bed, lounge area, nice roll top bath to have a glass of champagne in later, which I definitely will be doing. Perfect for a weekend getaway, or even if it's just an overnight stay. Lots to do in Wimbledon Village, so I think we're going to go and have a little explore and see what's out there. So, let's go. So we have come just five minutes down from the pub and hotel and we are on Wimbledon Common which is perfect for long walks at the weekend, if it's the summer or the spring you can come down for a picnic and it's great for taking the dog as well. And the Dog and Fox do have some dog friendly rooms um, and they have a puppy parcel package which includes a dog bed and dog treat. So if you're looking to keep your pooch happy for the weekend and bring it with you uh, then the Dog and Fox is definitely one to think about. So we are down in the centre of Wimbledon to show you some of the local attractions. You've got some great bars, some great restaurants, uh, good shopping as well, and the new Wimbledon theatre behind me if you're looking for a great night out. And another of the local attractions is uh, Wimbledon Village Stables, which is where we are. These are right behind the Dog and Fox Hotel, so really on your doorstep. Hello, this is Merlin, uh, and they offer down here, they offer group lessons, they also offer semi-private and private rides as well, um, down on the, on the common. So we thought we'd show you around some of the horses, and there's one person in particular that we thought we'd introduce you to. So this is Mr Fudge, he is a Wimbledon celebrity uh, down at Wimbledon Stables and actually in the village as a whole really, aren't you Mr Fudge? So we can bring you to all the local attractions without bringing you down to Wimbledon Tennis Courts, of course. Just a 10 minute walk down the road from the Dog and Fox Hotel. Uh, you have the tennis uh, museum that is open for visitors and you can go and have a look at that through gate number four. And obviously if you're here in the summer, you've got Wimbledon Fortnight, which is the first two weeks of July. You can either try and come and get some tickets or you can enjoy it, enjoy it in the village. So we are now back in the pub. I'm about to order some food and have a large glass of wine after my busy day. Um, so remember, if you are looking to stay in the capital, then have a look at the Dog and Fox. We've shown you all the local attractions that are in the area to keep you busy. And remember, you are just 15 minutes into central London. Cheers. 